More women versus men have MS by a margin of at least two to one and, and still growing. But this is not well reflected in clinical uh, study populations. Why not? Well, in my experience, there's no exclusion of female volunteers. Um, I guess it will partly reflect the nature of the clinic because the recruitment comes from the clinic and if in a certain place there's a bias that women are not able to access follow-up as uh, frequently or with the same, um, how can I put it, seniority of clinician, mm -hmm. i.e. if the clinician isn't an active trial recruiter, yeah. uh, then they simply won't, won't be considered for studies. Then of course it's a dynamic because these people are volunteers, so it might be that they're offered a study, but they think about the time constraints balanced against family responsibilities or work. And sometimes, of course, the uh, realization that the study will preclude any planned pregnancy throughout the period of the trial, which is a, a very standard requirement of any drug study, um, makes people think, I'm altruistic, but in my life plan, I'm not sure I can commit to uh, no, no uh, pregnancy for the next two, three, whatever years.